was checking to see if Nicholas was still breathing. <laughs> Why wouldn't I be breathing? You gave me quite a scare when I couldn't wake you the other night. I wanted to be sure the new pain medication wasn't having the same side effects. As you can see, he's breathing just fine on his own. Uh, uh, Colleen, would you get me a cup of coffee, please? Sure. <sighs> what was that about? You need to be careful around her, Nicholas. No, no, Colleen's harmless. If there's anyone to be worried about, it's my grandmother. I'm lying in this bed right now because of her. How can you be sure that it was Lena who cut the cinch to your saddle? Because she's trying to make a point. See, Spencer's the cast of Air now. She has no more use for me. Well, with Helena taking a special interest in Spencer, I really think you need someone around who's going to be able to keep him safe. Colleen has held her own with my grandmother on more than one occasion. Colleen's focus is on you, not Spencer. Her crush might compromise the safety of your son, Nicholas. I really think that you should consider replacing Colleen. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Alfred and I interviewed a, a parade of nannies, and Colleen was the best possible choice. Besides, Spencer's become attached to her. Spencer's a very easygoing baby. He's going to be just fine with another nanny. He's just gotten used to me and, 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 and the house and, and Colleen. I don't want him to have to deal with any more changes right now. All right, well, then I really think you should set some boundaries with Colleen. It, it's, it's a crush. She'll get over it. She hasn't so far. Nicholas, you trust me. You need to put a stop to this before it gets out of hand. This must be awkward for you. Bernie! Hi. Hi, you scared me. Oh, my apologies. I, everything all right? No, fine. I just didn't expect to see you. Uh, what are you doing here? Well, uh, I heard you were looking for Jason. Mitchie said it seemed important. And... It is. H have you seen him? Well, he's out of town for a while. I don't know when he's going to be back. So, is there anything I can do to help? Actually, I was trying to get in touch with Stan. Uh, I know that he does research for Sonny and Jason. Mm -hmm. Well, what is it that you need? I was hoping that Stan could do a background search on someone for me. I need to know everything I can about a nanny working for Nicholas Castine. Nanny. Colleen McHenry is as straight as they come on paper anyway. She pays her taxes, she votes on a regular basis, she has no criminal record. He couldn't even find a parking ticket. Okay. Well, please tell uh, Stan thank you for me. I didn't mean to waste his time. Well, maybe you didn't, because there is one thing that seems very off about her. What do her. you mean, off? Well, uh, you know, he searched her uh, employment history, and out of the five families that she worked for, there was trouble in three of them. What kind of trouble? Two of the fathers died unexpectedly while she was, well, she was caring for the children. Did it say how? Well... Medical examiner ruled it accidental in both cases, but... Oh, God. And the third? He vanished. Just without a trace. She was the last one to see him alive. Nicholas? Nicholas? 